Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Man kanat dunya hammahu, ja'ala allahu faqrahu bayna aynayn. Whoever makes this world his ambition, he has no concern for akhirah. Why do you study? So I can get a decent job later on. After you get your dream job, I will get married, of course. After getting married, while well, having kids and raising them. And then, I should get myself a house, buying this and that. So from the very beginning, Akhira has never existed in his mind. Only this dunya. His brain only processes things related to this worldly life. And he measures the value of everything with money. People in the West put it this way. Time is money. That is dunya. So when people talk about worldly ambition, they usually mean that for them, time is money. If you sit in the masjid, what will you get in the masjid? You sit there from Maghrib until Isha. What do you gain? But if you open a store, you earn money. You sell things online. Money comes to you. But if you sit in the masjid, you should spend for sadaqah. So because his only ambition is this world, this dunya, everything is valued on dunya terms. What will happen to people who make dunya their ambition? Allah puts poverty right before his eye. The fear of poverty is right before his eye. Subhanallah. The poverty is between his two eyes, said the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. 